host, Ethan Page. She is a man of many talents, a gamer, YouTube creator, and a professional wrestler. He is one half of the Impact Wrestling Tag Team, The North. If you have questions for Ethan, please put them in the comments and we will try and get them. We usually say where guests are joining us from, which has been home. But your latest YouTube episode suggests you may not be at home. So where are you joining us from today? I'm at home. This is actually my bedroom. We so I, I am home. Locked up for us, so. <laughs> What, has COVID-19 affected you professionally? How, Ooh, how? well, I'm traveling much less, so I'm home a lot more. But that's good because I have a daughter uh, who's taking a nap right now, so you're lucky or she'd be in the video with us. Um, I would say I'm traveling much less, so my body is healing a lot more from not having to wrestle as much. So I would say it affected me, but in a positive way. What is a body guy? What is a body guy? Can you guys do some flexes right now? Nope. I'm not gonna. Oh, you don't want to do one of these? It's really easy. You don't want to try? Not even one? Not one nope. flex. See? That's a body guy right there. Now you know. <laughs> Ow. Ow. There you go. Two body guys. What and you got you those injuries. Wait, how are you going to say you're not a body guy? You got those wrist guards on. It's like back day. What are your typical injuries you get in the rain? Typical injuries. My neck gets very sore and tight. My lower back, <clears throat> same thing, but that's probably a uh, hamstring problem. But uh, most of my injuries are honestly from having to travel and sit on pl in planes or cars for a very long time. Have you been able to train properly during COVID-19? Not really. Um, I have a gym in my house that I kind of built last minute during uh, COVID-19, but to tr say I'm training properly would be a lie. I'm trying my best to train as much as I can, but I uh, definitely don't have enough equipment to do it properly. Who is your dream opponent, living or dead for a match? The Rock. And any new hobbies you've picked up from quarantine? Um, my wife and I have started playing with Legos. Hmm. Yeah, we're building some Star Wars Rock. stuff. They came out for like the new May the 4th. I heard they came out with a $900 Millennium Falcon. That is 7,000 pieces. Whoa, that's huge. Well, Just that's not the one I'm doing. What console, what console do you play, play on? on? What console do I play on? PS4 and the Switch. Do I have to only pick one? Yeah. No. No. No, Tom. I'm an Xbox player. Ah. Oh, that's why. Okay. He also plays Nintendo Switch occasionally. Yeah, yeah, yeah see, I love the Nintendo Switch. That's what I'm going to do after this interview. The only what games do you play on the Switch? Ooh, Mortal Kombat 11, uh, mm -hmm. Mario Kart, Animal Crossing, Marvel Ultimate Alliance 3. Do you play Fortnite? I do not. I do not. Yeah, sorry. I'm not that cool. Nah. <laughs> What's your favorite game out of all of them? My favorite game out of all of them, I'm going to say even Mortal Oh, even on PS4. Oh, see, now that's hard. I would say my favorite game would be Grand Theft Auto V. Is there a lot of gaming that goes on behind the curtain at wrestling? Sometimes, yes. Uh, Rich Swan brings his PlayStation uh, with him and sets it up in his hotel. Sometimes he'll set up his N64 so that he can have no mercy tournaments. So some gaming does happen backstage. Um, but for the most part, we're all really busy and don't really have time to be able to do that. <laughs> Mark Andre asks, what is the appeal of Animal Crossing? Ooh, I don't know. I'm trying to figure it out too. 
it's uh it's just like a fun time killer i think people get to create stuff and make money but once i had more money in animal crossing than i did in real life i kind of didn't want to play it anymore <laughs> <laughs> my mom really wants animal crossing it sounds like a really good game well What's... my wife really loves the game what is your favorite game to stream on twitch fire pro wrestling because you could download any character I literally had Genie from Aladdin giving people tombstones. Will we start seeing Lego videos, Lego videos with him, with you then? Oh, yes. probably not. No, I so I ha I have too many projects. You know, I I actually don't accept interviews either. I uh, wanted to specifically do this one because I saw my friend Chris do it. So uh, I know how hard it is to start these kind of things. And I think it's awesome that you guys are doing it together too. You guys are brothers, right? Yeah, twins. Yeah, so that's, that's the best. Wait, you guys are twins? Yeah. yeah. You look nothing alike. Yeah, we're... Uh... That's the good part. Yes. <laughs> you just call your brother ugly? No, <laughs> possibly. No. I wouldn't say that. Mm -hmm. Hey, look at him. He's he's already got his wrestling wrist tape on. He's going to give you an RKO. He is powerful with the feet. I'm powerful with the hands. What? So you guys would be a perfect tag team then. Feisty Cheese asks if you can do the belt dance. Oh, I don't have the belt. I had to actually leave it in Nashville so that they could clean it for the next time we have uh, our tapings, which is a pay-per-view. So they wanted to make sure it was nice and clean. 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 <laughs> what does that mean? What are you guys, what are you guys insinuating? <laughs> what is your producer making you do? We fear for the cleaning. <laughs> what is your most challenging project? My most challenging project. Ooh, that's a really good question. I would say the making the cartoon was probably uh, my most challenging project while while in quarantine, just because I've never made a cartoon before, and the amount of editing that goes into sound effects and like adding all that stuff was very time consuming. And trying to get all the wrestlers on board with doing it uh, with a very short time period was very hard, but also very rewarding. So it was worth it. Where can we see the cartoon? You could see the cartoon on my YouTube channel, uh, youtube.com slash Ethan Page vlog, or just go to my website, playedbyjulian.com. We'll link it in the description. Probably. You're damn right that you will. Can you be? Okay, uh, if you weren't a wrestler, what would you be? Ooh, if I wasn't a wrestler, what would I be? Maybe like a stand-up comedian, an actor, uh, a gas station attendant. Um, I don't know, anything. But <laughs> I think I was meant to do this. Uh, so I try not to really worry about what I would have been doing if I wasn't. ARWP asks, when will Impact have wrestling figures? Like I would love to know the same. I would love to know the same thing. That's a great question. Uh, me personally, though, outside of Impact, I have my own action figure, uh, and it'll be coming out soon. So uh, stay tuned for that. I've posted a couple pictures of the mold for my head and stuff like that, and the outfit that it'll be made into. But uh, yeah, more details will come soon. Dude, so uh, I think it was on Twitter, you posted this fan art that you really liked. Uh, yeah. Are you thinking about doing anything else with it? No. So that was actually just a gift someone drew for me uh, yesterday. Sent me a very nice message about it. Uh, and I just wanted to share it because I think the artist definitely yeah. needs to be able to have a bigger following. Because it is an awesome picture, wasn't it? Yeah. You can do so much things with art. Oh, yeah. Uh, Owen Gale asks, what is the best thing about tag team cha champion? Being. Being, Being the tag team champion. Everybody wants to interview you. Like <laughs> you guys. Everybody wants to interview the tag team champion. That's the best part about it. You also be 
because you responded on one of our uh with the video with Chris. Yeah. Well, yeah. you guys got some famous interviews. So, you know, I want to be part of that. Obviously, you guys are good at your jobs. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I can I, This is probably the first job that I could keep. <laughs> oh, you've been you how many how many jobs have you been fired from? Zero. But Oh, at, okay. least good. at least it's good. <laughs> you're you're a hundred percent good at every job you've had. Then we assume you are the Shawn Michaels of the North. Ooh, who says that? Damn, you better be careful. Josh Alexander will find you. Or will he? Yeah, we'll be in our basement. That's a good question. <laughs> I like your confidence. Spicy Cheese asks, who wins in a no hold bars match? Match between Baymax and Aladdin. Wait, oh, okay. We can all answer this because I want to know who you guys are going to pick. Nope, I'm not going to. Baymax or Aladdin? The two characters, who? Baymax. I'm going to agree with Tom here. I'm with you guys. Aladdin is one of my favorite characters, but if we're talking real, who's going to win? A uh, barefoot street rat or a robot in like a Terminator outfit? Yeah. <laughs> right? Chances are, because people say this, and I think it's true, robots are going to take over the world. No, no. <laughs> that's, not, that's not what's true. This is what's true. What's oh. true? Cats are going to oh, okay. take over. With, with Who's going to take over? Wait, wait, wait. Cats Who's going to take over? Cats? Cats? Robots are going to take over the world. That's his prediction, everybody. What are your thoughts on the return of several stars to impact at Slammiversary? Ooh, I don't really care about that. Now I want to hear more about the cats and robots taking over the world. First, first the cats, the cats they we'll kill, kill everyone, everyone in the, in the store, store and eat all the tuna. Okay. Go on. Okay. And then just, I don't know, I don't he know. doesn't know. Yeah, this is a wild con thought. Okay, it just happened. It just happened. This happens every single time. Like the cheat, the pe the pineapple versus no pineapple debate. Oh yeah, what team are you? Pineapple or no pineapple on pizza? Oh, I say no pineapple, but I just yes! promise. Hold on, I did promise a friend of mine yesterday that I will try pineapple on pizza in 2020. So. so. I got okay. it. I, I'm saying no now, but it might change my mind. So we'll see. Okay. We will not tell Chris Van Vliet about pineapple. Yeah, Chris is on my team, I'm pretty sure. So you and Chris are on my team. Okay. Now. Yeah, but I have Strombo on my team, so. Uh, Mike Bierman says North top five tag team in the world. That was that's just a compliment, right? That's not a question. Yeah. <laughs> yes. I think so. What is the most challenging project? I think I answered that one. No. He, he's, that he's juggling, not the cartoon. That you're juggling, right now. Right oh, now. Cu currently, right now. Uh -huh. Yeah. I would say the hardest job I have right now is. Ooh, um, having a weekly vlog without leaving my house. So Gracie Suffolkin asks, is my good friend Supermax Super Fernandez back with Impact? Well, he was there when we were filming in Nashville, so. Dun, 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 dun. Mm, boop, boop, boop. So... How will bumps affect you when they come back to the ring? Oh, man. Well, I had to wrestle this past week, so I uh, I know what that's all about. And uh, it affected me greatly. My body still hurts, and I've been home for a couple days. Uh, are you tired of washing your hands yet? I don't, I don't know if we're allowed to be tired of washing our hands. I, think, I feel like that should just be normal. You, you don't go outside, you don't have to wash them. <laughs> just how to wash them, Tom. Well, well yes. it's called sanitary. 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 Thank you. you don't wash wash them. I mean, I mean like, like being, like being clean, clean or, something. or something. Yeah. 
You got to wash your hands. Hold on. I have a question. So I understand that if you're outside of your house, you have to wash your hands. But what if you wipe your butt inside the house? Yeah. Wash your hands. There you go. So it's not just outside of the house. You got to wash your hands all the time. Yeah. Tom, you've been proven wrong. <laughs> Wait. Are we talking about the washing hands proven wrong, or are we talking about cats taking over the world? I think uh, I think the washing the hands thing. Okay, so the cats is still an option. Yep, cats is still an option. Okay. Look at that! I've been seeing the cat, the look my cat's been giving me for the past couple of days. I know he's gonna take over the world. So you cats think it's can, possible? Cats can murder birds, then they'll murder bigger animals, then they'll murder humans. No, they won't murder them. They'll take us as slaves. Only the cat people, though. Why did you start a YouTube channel? Was it because <laughs> you missed the... Go ahead. Okay. Why did you start the YouTube channel? Was it because of the previous success of being the elite and Sammy Guerrero's... Guerrero. Guerrero's <laughs> channel? No. Uh, so I actually started a vlog when I was with Evolve Wrestling many years ago, but uh, I felt like I wasn't getting the success I wanted for the amount of work I was putting into it, and the company wasn't very supportive of it, uh, so it kind of died down. Then when I ended up getting back with uh, Impact, my wife really pushed me to have it because we just had a kid and a lot of interesting stuff was happening. So she said, okay, well, didn't, you didn't like it so much the first time, but try it again. And this time, don't do it for, like, views or likes or whatever. Do it for, you know, to document your kids growing up and while you're leaving the house. And so, yeah, that's what we did it for. And now I'm dedicated to doing it every single week. Kurt Stallion says, shout out Gabe. What's up? Uh, Grace and stuff can ask, can you do the pupil's eyebrow? I can only do it on one side. Are you ready for this? I'll give you the good one and the bad one. That's the good one. Does that you guys get approval? It's good people's. That's good. Mhm. Mm okay, you guys ready for it? No, not working. This is it. I'm trying my best. Sorry, guys. A for effort. A for effort. A for effort. Your video styles seem to influence by Casey Neistat and Peter McKinnon. Are those two influences on you? Uh, yeah, with how they edit their vlogs, yeah, for sure. I think there's like a natural style that's easy to digest, and, and they kind of mastered it. What do you use to edit? Final Cut 10 on a MacBook. Owen Gale 5 asks if you would like to wrestle Chris Bay. Yeah, he's great. Chris Bay is fantastic addition to the Impact roster, and uh, yeah, I'd like to wrestle him for sure. Have you ever wrestled in Western Canada for PWA or CWE or High Impact? I have not wrestled for any of those, but I've wrestled in Winnipeg for Winnipeg Pro. Is your family tired of you yet? Is what? Say that again? Is your family tired of you yet? Yeah, I think they are. My my wife did get a break from me, though, when I went to Nashville. So uh, I think she's got her, like, you know, batteries recharged to put up with Ethan Page being home. Have you ever wrestled MJF? <laughs> I have wrestled MJF, yes. Did you beat him? Uh, we've both won and lost against each other. But I think I've beaten him more times than he's beaten me. Sorry about Yay! that. Yay! MJF isn't the best. Uh, no, we can all, all all three of us can hate him in the chat. Where do you, where do you find the inspiration? Is it from quotes or certain people talking? Um, honestly, it's just like something I have inside. Like I try not to actually pay attention to pop culture or like fads. Um, I kind of just do my own thing and realize as long as I like listen to my gut and don't be a bad person. Nine times out of ten, I'll do the right thing, and it'll end up being well. Okay, so someone asked, Feisty Cheese asked this, but I have no idea what a Frosty is. Frosty is. Wait, what? 
Wendy's Frosty? You've never had one? We only have one Wendy's here. My goodness, you poor children. I've never had Wendy's. Never had Are Wendy's. You, in your oh, life? Nope. We've never had a square hamburger. You've never had a square hamburger? You're hilarious. <laughs> Oh, that's funny. Does anybody have some questions? Because we have no more. We are blank. The only question we need to ask is, to, should Tom cut his hair? Yes. Should I keep it long or should I trim it? Not He oh. should trim it. He should trim it. Trim it or keep let's, it long. Yeah, let the, people, let the people comment. Comment in the chat. Most votes win. Yeah, should Tom cut his hair? Show them how long it is. Show them the luscious locks. I'm looking my hairdresser isn't on the show. Oh, and there, we, by the way, me and Bob get to vote. I want to keep it long. We're okay. going to... Two votes. Two votes. You know what? I'll vote for you to keep it long, too. I support I you. Vote, I vote nay, because I'm actually cutting my hair no matter what. So... See, Feisty Cheese says, shave it all off. Bald is beautiful. <laughs> Shave it all. His mom wouldn't allow that. <laughs> okay, so I think last uh, votes coming wait, in. I think uh, Sony actually earlier said keep it long. Oh yeah, he did. Four. Uh, uh, meanwhile, I'm just sitting here a lonely one. You're hoping. Yeah, I'm not hoping it. I'm just. I'm just sitting I want to keep it long. I think I think your vo the votes are in. <laughs> So thank you for joining us, and maybe we, no what, if oh you, somebody's neutral. Ah, okay, whatever. Okay, so oh, thank you for joining us. Maybe we can do a future episode if you come to Regina. And thanks for joining us. See ya. No problem, guys. See you later. <laughs>